Hello, welcome back again. Today we need to get the answer for the problem I assigned you. I'm trying to get a little bit more excited because I've done like five of these videos today and I'm tired as shit. I drink a lot of coffee but it's still not kicking in. So I've resorted to drinking water over and over again because it makes me have to get up and go to the bathroom every two minutes. <laughs> Alright, cool. So where we left off last time is we, we wrote this frames page and uh, we have our little heading here, our little title that we wrote. Uh, we want to convert these into links and we want to open up our links on the right side of the page here. Sounds like a damn fine time to me. So this is where we left off. We actually wrote all this code together. I haven't even closed my com computer off since then. Everything is still sitting here. So I'm going to close everything except for the pages that we just were working on. Which is kind of funny because we're not going to really need this right that HTM except for when we first open it. So why don't we just go ahead and just mess with this and let's change it a little bit. So uh, when we first open it, it's going to have something here. And what I want to do is let's go um, minimize everything and go out on Internet Explorer. Google.com. Uh, let's see, what, what did we do last time? It was Color Mixer. Color Mixer. Load, baby, load. There she is. There's the link that we used last time. Let's go to blue again. Let's find another shade of blue to use. I don't know. Should we go darker? I'm not an artist, man. We might. Let's try to keep the same theme. Let's. I don't know. What is this going to look like on that side? Let's do that. Let's open up right. 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 I'm not humming any particular song, just trying to make some noise. Does that do those colors look alright together to you? They look okay to me, but like I said, I don't do the art thing. Let me just try what what the hell? We're already playing anyways. Let's make this video two hours long so you guys can just sit there and watch me while I play. Let's leave okay, that's pretty. Beautiful. Awesome. It, it reminds me of looking up at the sky. I feel... Oh, I just feel so happy looking at that. Okay. So let's convert these into links. Sound like a whole lot of fun to you? Great. Um, let's do something here real quick. Uh, let's go back to our left. I'm going to erase our P here. Bring this down here. Let me see if I can do this. Honestly, I don't even know if I can... Uh, I should be able to. Um chugga 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 chug chug chug. What if I just did another P? Um This is kind of a test for myself. I still haven't even closed it, so it should bring this up, but it doesn't. Alright, well why don't we just do this? Let's keep everything in the same paragraph. That way it's nice and together. We'll do it this way. Does that look cool to you guys? Because it looks a little better to me. Alright, so let's work on this right page. Um, the first thing we need to do is we need to create these as hyperlinks. So what I'm going to do, and uh, let's go back and look at some of the old things that we wrote. Let's see, hyperlinks. So they start around here. We got a hyperlink for the fire. Alright, that's where they started. Seven. What did we, what did we learn in eight? We worked on the top here, so we're going to need that. We'll keep 8 open. And what did we do in 9? Nine? 9. We did this. Where's the one that we did the style? Was it 10? Yes. Okay. I don't think I need anything from 9. Except for maybe this top part. I'll close that, though. 8. We're going to steal that from 8. 7. We got a hyperlink in 7. We also have one in 8, so we can just close that. All right, in case we need to refer back to anything, we have these references. We have the old documents that we wrote. So let's start at left.htm. Now we know how to write a hyperlink, right? Everything is here, good to go. So let's write one. Left, left, there she is. A. And this is going to be, remember, and I closed it already, which is stupid me. My documents my webs lesson 12 and then we got pages so we gotta go forward slash pages 
right? So we got to do pages forward slash, um, and then this is going to be index dot htm because that's what we called lesson one, right? Lesson one, and then this is going to be slash a. Save it. So we have a hyperlink here. Nothing too fancy. We need to edit this, uh, the prettiness of it later. But watch what happens when I click on it. it. It actually opens up in this. Okay? Remember the target thing? We set up targets. So let's mess with our targets. Um, if we go back to context, we had, and we open up our lesson number eight, we have this. Target equals blank. Let's right click that, let's copy that, and we'll put that in our left.htm. I guess we'll put it inside the head here. So we got base target blank. Instead of blank, I want them to open up on the right side. So what did we call the right target? We called it main. So if we do this, check this out. If I change this to main and save it and refresh my page, it opens up on the main target. So that's on the right side. So we're doing pretty damn good already. So I'm actually going to cheat because you guys know I like to cheat. I'm going to erase all these, copy it, and of course I want to change this to lesson 02 because we did that. Copy. 2, 3, uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And now we got to go back and change this. Lesson 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And we got to change our links. We got 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Save it. And refresh the page. We should have links. That works. That works, that works, that works. Oh my goodness, we are so good, aren't we? Uh oh, we got it. We didn't copy our image folder over. We have to do that in order for these images to show up. Let's do that. We're gonna go up a directory, up a directory, and remember the image directory. Actually, no, because that was in lesson seven. Yeah, there's the two fire images. We gotta copy fire over. Copy. Go back to 12 pages, and I'm actually going to paste fire. If I refresh this page, there we go. Now we're in business. We got eight, we got nine, and we got lesson 10. And of course, this is the exact same lesson, but we're doing it much cooler. Now, why don't we add a neat little effect like we have on this page? That looks kind of neat. Ah, drinking my water. First thing we got to do is we got to open up our left. So here we are in left. So let's change our visited link because we don't like that orange color. A visited link is going to be hmm black, not pound black. It'll be black. A regular link will be red, and if it's okay, white. If it's that's fine. That works for me. I'm happy with that. Now if we go to lesson ten. Remember our little style that we created? Let's copy that. Whoops. Whoa! I don't know what I just did. I think I closed it by accident. Sorry about that. We'll copy that. And let's go back to our left. And remember that styles go inside the head tag, so we'll paste that in there. So now we have it, so when we put our mouse cursor over it, it'll be red, it'll be italic. Just like we had before. Refresh. Oh my goodness gracious. We are performing the absolute greatest web designing project known to man. That even works. That even works. Cool. Why is sick? Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Had a little bit of a snag there. But you see how, how we can make our pages a little bit more interesting. So we have completed the requirements. Um, so, you know, good luck, uh, program uh, on your own, play with this, you know, make your own little web page, and, uh, you know, keep the excitement rolling, keep yourself interested in frames, and here's the answer to the lesson. 
So why don't we just kind of recap the code real quick. I'm going to close off the other lessons that I opened for reference. We didn't change anything about index. Index did exactly the same. Um, let's close that. And uh, let's see here. We got top. What did we change to top? Nothing. Top stayed exactly the same as we did in the previous lesson, so I'll close that. Right, all that we did was we had a starting background color, so if I actually, if I go to index.htm, this is where it's going to start. It's going to start me like this. Okay, so this is what we did to write. That's all that we did to it. Let's close it. Left.htm is the only thing we really changed. We changed our, um, our base, um, yeah, so our target for our default links will now go to main okay so that means it's going to open up in our main target which is on the right side of the frame um, we also do have these styles right here so this style is basically going to do the hover over the link so when we get over the link it's going to be red and it's going to be italic um, we're going to end our head tag our body this was pretty much just copied and pasted from the other program but we'll go over it our background color is that mixed color that we made before our text is going to be black um, even though we don't really need that because we actually yes we do that's going to make this so it's black why don't we change that color real quick we'll make it um, red that way we can see a difference here okay so that's going to be red and these will be black with red when we go over top of them and that's because of the this of course um, our visited links will be black our links would all uh, be red if it hadn't been visited previously and while it's being active it's going to be white top margin zero left margin zero right margin zero we uh, we did that in the previous lesson uh, we aligned in the center the link here and we went ahead and just kind of got rid of our uh, closed paragraph and put it towards the end here so everything would be nice and aligned in the center and also that everything that this would be pressed right up against this nice and pretty looking um, what else we got here uh, we also added our links we didn't specify a target because by default they're all going there and that's pretty much everything we did. There's the code. Here's the meat of everything we changed. So code it by yourself. Enjoy yourself. And we will see you again soon.